Hi, this is Jill coming to you this morning to do a quick uh, flip through or a quick um, take on my recent haul from Walmart. Um, I got these, I think, on Thursday. Um, I happened to stop at Walmart to pick up a few things and as is my usual uh, I don't know what the word is. I'm sorry. I'm. It's early in the morning and I haven't quite woken up yet. Um, but as my usual procedure is, I guess, I do have to go check out the office supplies and the school supplies, especially when school supplies are out for the new school year. And they had some things at my Walmart that usually my Walmart doesn't have. Um, usually I have to go into Corpus um, Corpus Christi to, to get a Walmart that has a better variety than what my Walmart does. But anyway, I picked up these things um, for not, uh, some of them were a nice price. Some, well, all of them were a nice price. I think the whole uh, stack of things that I have here was about 50 bucks. So not bad for everything that I got. So I'm going to start with the sticker books. They had four new sticker books as you can see here this one has the floral cover this one has a dot cover this one is like a watercolor and then this one looks like a peacock feather um, and I should have peeled the tape off of these so that I could open them before I started this and I didn't but we'll do a quick flip through of this one um, their stickers in the previous sticker books have been um, very easy to use. They are a little bit bigger than the Happy Planner boxes, but you can usually make them work. Um, and I'm sure these are geared more towards maybe the student, uh, since they were in the back to school section, they weren't with the um, regular school supplies where their planner things usually are. But th I think these were $2.88 for each book. And, um, you know, they have a lot of nice functional stickers in them. So it says there's 735 stickers in that book. This one has 748. I'm just going to peel it back. Looks like the first page of the last two is all washy. There's gold foil stickers in some. Now you can see these are geared towards more school related because there's like a microscope for science. I'm sure the scissors are for crafts. I'm not sure what this one is at the bottom. It looks like a lollipop, but anyway. But just some cute stickers. Uh, you know, you can easily see that they'd be nice to use uh, in your planners. A lot of nice functional planners, checklists, banners. I love these that are the breakfast, lunch, and dinner stickers. And this one has 497, so not as many stickers in this one, but still, um, maybe there's bigger stickers. I don't know. We're going to see. Oh, wow, look at that. No, sorry for my washer making noise. I love anything that has days of the week stickers. Those come in so handy, especially for redating things or for using in your bullet journal. Um, again, lots of checklists. Again, the breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Functional things, flags, banners. I love these too. Those are nice. Nice little functional stickers there headers and track habit trackers and then the washi and this one is at the back and then this one has 571 
stickers. I can't find the where the tape is to peel it off. starts with the washi and nice blues and greens again days of the week stickers that's always awesome these are a little bit smaller it looks like so maybe these would work better in a mini happy planner or in smaller spaces I know that's probably supposed to be a bell, but it always looks like a mushroom to me, and I was never sure what I was going to use that for. So those are some nice bell do stickers. Weekend banners. And that's it for the sticker book. So that, that was four sticker books. They were each $2.88. This is an accessory pouch from Pen and Gear. Um, I love the polka dots. It has a big pocket here on the front. It has these straps that you can strap it around the cover of your planner and then it's zippered so you have, take out the phone, a big pouch to put your planner things in. You can put scissors, washi tape, stick your pens in here and just attach that to the front of your planner. Uh, the, this pocket here has kind of like a shiny oh look that's why these are pen pockets here <laughs> see you learn something new every day but i believe that was i don't remember how much that one was i'll have to look at my receipt and maybe i can figure out how to put a a little blurb of how much that one was the next thing i got was this journal now, I took part in One Book July, and One Book July this year was uh, bullet journaling and getting back to the basics of bullet journaling, reading the book by Ryder Carroll called The Bullet Journal Method, and um, you know, creating a bullet journal that worked for you. So right now I'm obsessed with anything with dot grid. And this is dot grid. So I picked this up. I want to say this was like $2. Um, maybe not. I'll have to, look, again, look at my receipt. There is 160 pages. It's a nice size. And uh, this would be great for a bullet journal if you want to get started, try it out. Um, the only downside is you're going to have to number your pages because these this one doesn't have numbers. I did have one that did have numbers but it was a little bit more expensive but I loved the color on this the gold foiling on the front and the spine is gold foil so that was awesome there and then they had this which was a mini happy planner and it's a happy notes I loved the cover I think that's why I bought it it says pencil it in with polka dots with some gold foiling on it the inside is kind of a striped and um, this was $12.88, so great price, considering they're usually like, I don't know if they're $19.99, if you get them at Hobby Lobby or Michael's or Joann's. The first divider says, stay colorful, babe. And it comes with this dotted lined uh, paper in it. So technically you could use this as a bullet journal just draw your boxes using the dots um, you could use it as a regular journal this divider says shine bright with sunglasses I love the dividers because they are double-sided so that's always nice and this divide divider says treat yourself with an ice cream cone and it also came with some journaling stickers and some regular stickers 
and this divider that's got like a coating on it, so I guess you could put some sticky notes on there. That's kind of interesting. I've never seen that before. Um, and then a folder. And then the back cover. So again, not bad for $12.88. Then this was also $12.88. This is one of their Traveler's Notebooks. It's kind of like a B6 size. Um, and inside it has uh, pockets on the front cover. So you have some slotted pockets here. It has a secretarial pocket there. It comes with two inserts. This first one is a grid on the front page, and then it has uh, like a habit tracker um, for each week. You use one for each week to get things done. And I'm not sure how many pages there are in each. It says the weekly pages, there's 140. And then this one is a dot grid. And it says that one has 140 pages also. So you could use that for a bullet journal also. Um, the back cover has a pocket there, and then it does come with a pen loop. And again, that was $12.88. And I think there's four strings. So you have the inserts that are on two. And then there are two additional strings that you can see right here. One there and one in there too. I can't get my fingers in there. And they, came, they had other colors. They had pink. They had this black. Um, I want to say there was a blue one also. But I got the black. You can see it was kind of thrown around, but it'll still be good. And then washi. These were, I want to say these were $1.88 for a package of four washies. So this one has blues and greens. It says hello, hi. Hello, hello. Um, has some flying birds, a nice watercolor blue. Uh, can't read what that one says. Don't just fly, soar. And then uh, stripes. And this one has the stripes, so that's it looks like it's a little bit different color stripes on it. This one says love, smile, laugh. Some A pink background one with colorful dots. This one says notes, to do, ideas. And then this one is white with some colorful dots on the top and bottom. This one is pinks. So the top one is a white background with black stripe and then some pink flowers. And this one says, okay, Monday, let's do this. And this one is a floral. And then you have a black one with gold foil dots. And then this one here says, enjoy today. And those, I said, like I said, were $1.88. So all of this together was about 50, I want to say 56 bucks, $56. So quite a lot for 56 bucks. If you get a chance, go check out your Walmart and see what you can find there. They did have stencils also. I've purchased those in the past. Um, and they're like $2 and something for a package of eight stencils. Uh, just, you know, don't forget about checking your Walmart for your planning supplies because they sometimes have great deals. Um, so I thank you for joining me for this quick flip through. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions or any comments, please leave them below. If you'd like to check out my Instagram, you can find me at Jilly Beans Planner Nook. And if you liked this video, press the like button. If you'd like to subscribe to my channel, you can press the subscribe button. And I hope you'll come back and join me um, again for another video. So thanks, have a great day, and we'll see you next time.